Did you? I, I listen when I listen to the extended version. I I really think that's Patty, Patty in the background. You think so? I do because I Patty has this has this distinct. <laughs> she has this distinct, and those weather girls could sing, and Martha Wash was a belter. Yes, she was. But no one was a belter like Patty. Was. Craig Patty is eighty years old. Right? I know. <clears throat> She's eighty. That's right. Not a lot of people can sing that well. In Dionne Warwick is one of them. Oh, well, she did in her time. She did in her time. She did what needed to do. Right. What must be done. She did what must have. You know who else can't sing anymore? Is that Freddie Jackson? Oh, <laughs> you okay? Sometimes it gets in the throat. <laughs> Something got in his too. Sometimes it gets in the throat. And I'm talking about Freddie Jackson. I am too. <laughs> Dance tonight. Hey! Dance tonight. Oh! Oh! Dance tonight. Hey! 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 Yes, indeed. Okay, let's get let's get into our little grammar class real quick. This is gonna go real fast. Okay, because we're not gonna stay on this. Because you should have learned this when you were in elementary school Come somewhere. Come on, Craig, pull the children together. Okay, where's the where's the definition? Because he simply could have just gone to Google. Uh -huh. You could have just simply gone to Google instead of sending me a message. You could have just gone to Google. But you know, some of you like to speak so confidently wrong. <laughs> Craig, they did not like that you told them that it was a homonym, an acronym, or a synonym. So one of the children first said, "Well, y'all won't be able to see this on TikTok, so you have to watch it to watch the show." Yeah, and, and we, playback. Yeah, we put the assets up on on the screen here. So somebody was like, "Well, I think you meant acronym." I said, "No, I meant a homonym." Well, and I said, "In fact, it can be both." Can we display it? Yes. Yeah, we're talking about the word fag. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, we call the word fag, which is popular hot ass gossip, uh -huh. which makes it an acronym. Okay. Because each initial means something, it stands it for represents. something. It represents. It yeah, represents. That's right. And representation matters. It does. Okay. But, you know, of course, it's a play on words. Uh huh. So it's a double entendre. Uh -huh. <laughs> Wait, put it back, Mo, because oh, okay. we wasn't done. All right, sorry. We wasn't done. It's a double entendre. It'll get me a, it make mine a double. <laughs> right. Entendre. <laughs> right. Okay. So it's also, you know, we, we mean it, we mean, we're using it as fag, as a pejorative. Uh huh. F A G. Now, here it says homonyms, homonyms are pronounced the same words and differ in meaning or spelt. I like the way they put spelt. Yes. Past tense. Or spelt the same and differ in pronunciation. Right. For, For example, example, go ahead, go ahead. Buy as in to purchase. Uh huh. And buy as in next to. Uh -huh. So those are homonyms. Okay. Homophones are words with the same pronunciation. But, but different, different spellings, spellings and, and meanings. meanings. Hopefully, we clarify that for you all today. Because what? Move that ball. Hold on. So okay. quick and say his okay. line. Communication is our partner, uh -huh. and clarity is our friend. <laughs> so, fag, it's a homonym, uh -huh. and it's an acronym. There you now, go. We're not talking about this anymore. No more. Oh, because there were some other assets that you said. Oh, okay, but well, show them. Let's okay. go ahead. So, here we go. What is the difference between a homonym and a homoph? Wait a minute. I thought I saw that wrong. <laughs> you, 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 you about to say homophobe? I was going to say homophobe. I said, wait, I saw it wrong. Hold uh -huh, on. Uh -huh. That's that Lexia kicking in. All well, right. What, what is it, girl? Lexia. Uh-huh. As in dyslexia. As in dyslexia. That's that Lexia kicking in. What is it about that group? Yes. Really quick. What is the difference between a homino, a homonym and a homophobe? A homophobe. Okay. <laughs> Homonyms are words that have different meanings but are pronounced or spelled the same way. There are two types of homonyms. Homo homophones and, and homographs. Homograph. Homophones sound the same but are often spelled differently. Kind of like a homophobe. Correct. <laughs> okay. So the next time you try to try to gather me, make sure you have everything together. Okay. <laughs> now I can be wrong. It doesn't happen often. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can be wrong. I feel you. Yeah. It's the same for me. Correct. <laughs> Correct. And that's why we're fags. That's why we're fags. <laughs> We're fags and friends. We're fags first, but we're friends too. <laughs> Speaking of, did you all read the article of us over in Gay Magazine? 
Yes, that was so I beautiful. It was. We I want to give it. a special shout out to Gay Magazine yes. for, for, for taking the time and want, wanting to take the time, which I feel like that is a step in the direction for publications that are gay led. Yes. Yeah. That are gay led to do their due diligence in the community. It's okay for you to be messy, shady, late, whatever. However, there should be a balance. There should be a balance within your if you are a gay led blog. That's right. Take notes over there at Neighborhood Talk. Gay led blog. No, we use a lot of neighborhood talk stuff. I like neighborhood. I know, but it, sometimes they're not socially responsible either. Come on, Craig. What they not? Socially responsible. <laughs> Ooh, can you break that down? Is it a harmony or an acquiesce? <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna acquiesce right there. We can acquiesce now. God, you're supposed to let me do that. <laughs> I wanted to acquiesce. 